two proudest moments of Big was number one, when he won the Source Award. I was extremely proud of him. I could see it in his eyes. It was like he wanted that thing so bad, you know? That was his championship. That was like, that, that was one of his shining moments. And then when the whole thing was together and we did the Soul Train Music Awards and he was like, he's coming down the elevator and he's the Don and he's cleaned up now and he's coming, you know, this is his, his return. You know, those, 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 were, those were proud moments for me. And another proud moment was, was, was his interview that he did on KMEL, just seeing him mature because, you know, I was always the one trying to, you know, um, Tell them let's protect, you know, we gotta protect things. And um, so we can't fall for the okie doke. And so to see him take that lead and to see him articulating himself like that in that interview, that's a whole changed man. That's a whole different person from the ready to die person. So knowing that you can have a positive impact on somebody's life and they wanna actually change. Life After Death, that album represents change. You're seeing like, a man going from a gangster rapper to actually evolving and changing. He's popping his shit, he's going through his, his maturation, but he's giving you glimpses of what he really wants to become and what's really inside of him.